sync. So, <laughs> we're now playing the Toonami tie-in games. Yay. The Ew. Intruder, being the first, was actually pretty neat. It gave us the uh, transition from Tom 1 to Tom 2. Which is pretty neat. <laughs> Steve oh, Blum Jesus. to voice Tom. This looks like that Jumpstart game you stream a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well be. No, um... Technically, I don't have to save any of these Clydes, they just affect my rating at the end. The point of the first episode is to find my way to the Absolution. Which is pretty bad as ship name. But because there's really nothing else to do besides getting through the maze, I kind of collect a bunch of Clydes along the way. Well, like they're the, all uh... on your way. Yeah. Well, and they add time to that timer at the top there. I like the, like, <laughs> eight-second music sample. Yeah. It was their first tie-in event, so they get a little slack. A little. Yeah. I don't, know. I don't think I ever played this because I was too busy just watching Toonami. I don't think I ever completed these episodes when they were first out. I was a dumb child. I don't think I even played these when they were first out. I might have played them, and I don't remember them. I do remember that there used to be oh. some sort of weird video editor thing that you could play around with clips from the lockdown thing, or the intruder, I can't remember which. I don't know, but the, uh, one of the big selling points of the intruder when it was airing was, you decide the outcome. And I think the original intention was the games kind of were supposed to do that, but no. The you decide the outcome basically affected... Hey, we lost an engine. Now we have to replace them. Choose the next design! Oh, <gasps> that's actually pretty cool. I remember that. I thought about it. Oh. We gotta yeah, watch like Tonight tomorrow. Had... Okay, we'll see you next time. Oh. <laughs> they had a week of episodes, then... Then there were, like, two, uh... Episodes that aired, like, months later, having to do with that engine thing. By the way, the intruder is chasing us now. Yeah, I noticed that. Um, so, oh, shit. can you identify what the intruder is here? Because I kind of forgot. A blob. Oh, just a sentient evil blob? Yes. Silly putty. That's great, goo. In fact, it, it's the. As of this recording, Toonami is doing a, another tie in event that's airing on Adult Swim The Intruder 2. Intrude harder. <laughs> No, but, uh, interesting thing, the intruder now, uh, has parts of Tom 1 sticking out of him. Hmm. Which I find... Are they cool. just as low-poly as as you used to be? Actually, yeah, kind of. <laughs> you. You could call that the, uh, degradation over time of being stuck in the intruder. Huh. Oh no, oh, yeah, the Ooey Gooey is was... gonna get you. Yeah. No. Uh, do you need the Clydes in this one? No. <laughs> ah. In fact, I think the winning run just completely ignores them. And these bio samples always appear at the same places. Okay. So after a RL Stein's coming to get you. That. Yeah. That's kind of the annoying thing is uh, there. Three of these four episodes have uh, the in them, so you'll be hearing that alarm a lot. Oh, I see. Huh. I don't know, it meshes pretty well with the six second music clip on this one. Yeah. <laughs> this looks like Chip's Challenge, that's what it reminds me of. Chip's Challenge is a good game. This feels like it should be a DOS game. Shit, I think I might have still had Windows 95 when this was out. <laughs> well, Chip's Challenge is now on Steam, so was it Windows 95? I remember having Windows Millennium, and I played this, I think. Oh boy. Oh, yeah. Windows and me. <laughs> me? I am the Windows. <laughs> Oh gosh. 
Uh, Someone's hell. spilling ink. Who spilled their coffee on the floor, huh? The intruder. He's knocking over everything. You'd knock over everything if you were a giant blob, too. Oh no, I got a poor rating because I didn't collect any of the Clydes. Oh no. Better wait for the oh no. next episode. See you then. Previously on Lockdown. I mean, the intruder. I can't remember which. <laughs> well, there was a third Toonami tie-in game, uh, Escape from Hyperspace, but unfortunately that has been lost to time. Even the oh. Wayback Machine can't recover that? Nope. It won't play uh. on the Wayback Machine. Oh, this is gigantic, but me, so but yeah, now we have to, to me. run from... Yeah, we have to run from the intruder. Alright. That's fine. Now, I assume this series, we're going to show we can get rid of the intruder too, or was that just an Italian episode? That was just in the episodes. The, uh... Well, I linked the, uh... videos in the thread, so... Okay. Basically, uh, Tom blew off the engine that the intruder was consuming to get rid of it. Ah, Tom 1 or Tom 2? Tom, Tom no. 2. Oh. And why is that door shut? You let that Clyde die. Monster. Oh, man, isn't, this a, yeah. isn't that a Doc and not a Clyde? No, Docs are the next one. They're well, he picked up a Clyde and when the intruder, like, hovered over it, it blew up. Oh, okay, Like yeah. what happens to us. We're technically a Clyde as well, just a more advanced model. Ah, oh, alright. So yeah, since that door up top is locked, I think I have to press that button to open it or something, but I'm just going to stick to the bottom now. <laughs> Why is all because this I know shit there's an down, open here. Doorway down here? Tom doesn't come down here to do anything. All he does is host cartoons. Well, that's what yeah, he you have to... For. Yeah, this ship is like... 50 floors at least. All for Tom and Sarah and the Clydes. Look, man, and Sarah's not even physical. Work. That's why uh, Moltar had to retire. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Pro Moltar. Well, he had to go to Space Coast, Coast to Coast. Yeah, so he can pull no, knobs and letters, levers in that coast. one. <laughs> I don't think he even pulled knobs or levers. Well, he pulled him once. I, he I know that. A few, one. but he was mostly messing around with his TV screen. Yeah. So now for this one, I do actually have to collect the Clydes. Oh, uh, and it <sighs> slows you down too. Yeah. Although I only need five of them, so. Oh, hey, the guy with the band is warming up. Uh, yeah. Just a couple of beats here. <laughs> this stuff oh, did gosh. not age well at all. Oh, no. so. When will this amoeba leave me alone? I don't want to buy. I don't want to buy a subscription to Science Magazine. Go away. <laughs> it wants to consume all things electronic, apparently. Well, it's not doing a really good job at it. Look at all this electronic stuff that it's not consuming. Yeah. These weird cauldron-like things. They're not electronic, they're structural. My oh. excuse, I'm sticking with it. That might be witch's cauldrons. Oh. And that's all the Clydes I need. So that's how the ship is powered. Oh no. Oh no. Nope. My coffee stains. <laughs> God damn it. Get away. I lost one. Oh, man, that's what happens when it's you okay. spill your ink. There's more where that came from. Just gotta find it though. Just crack open one of the uh, radioactive crates there and see if it kills a critter. Yeah, but that'd be too easy. Might make it stronger. Also, I like how Tom, apparently, uh, according to this game, is hoarding nuclear waste onto this ship. He just keeps it here. Oh yeah, by the way, this episode 4 was when Tom was eaten by the intruder. Ah, so he's already dead by this point. Yeah, I think, in fact, the first sentence of the, uh... This one said Tom is dead. Yeah, it said he was consumed or something, yeah. But is he truly dead when he was never Back alive when to begin with? Dead and consumed and all that stuff could actually be said on Cartoon Network. <laughs> Instead, he was sent to the other dimension. Sent to the shadow Even realm. more apparent when you watch all the old Wada cartoons as well. <laughs> 
Yeah, I will give them credit for transitioning mascots by actually creating a plot line to get to change them out. You don't really see that that much. No. Well, the transition to uh, from Tom 2 to Tom 3 was done. Oh no, Tom's dead! Comic. Oh my god! <laughs> Wait, did we pass that part? Yeah. yeah I didn't watch Tsunami, sorry. Tom. Hey guys, we're getting the R-Type back. Yeah. This one is a pain in the butt. This one oh, no. is another timed maze like the first one, but it's a lot tighter of a time limit. I see that. So basically, we're the engine that got jettisoned, and now we're trying to find our way back to the ship before we die. Yep. So it's actually a good idea to collect the Clyde, so that way you get more time. So my question is, why does this Clyde even matter if we can just rebuild them? I mean, they obviously did that with Tom. Because we needed a, some kind of player avatar. I suppose. Are they the ones Tom that was do a busy doing the show. Anyway? Yeah. He just pushes buttons and says things. In uh, the first episode of Lockdown, we get introduced to a garbage Clyde. <laughs> And a cell phone ringtone for background music. Holy shit, man. It's really charming just because it keeps stopping every couple of notes. We gotta, we gotta buffer the song again. Hang on. <laughs> it's it's well, 1997 again. So yeah, this one took me about 20 minutes to do because I kept failing. Jesus. But anyway, that was it for the Intruder game. Be sure to check oh, out the conclusion on Tanami next week. All right.